All right, welcome back, guys. Hopefully you figured out what that answer was, but we'll get to the answer a little bit later on in the show. But first, let's go ahead and jump into things. Who are you guys, and what are you guys doing here? What do you, what do you want to show off? Hi. Well, I'm Mary Elaine Moore. Mm -hmm. I'm Stacy Brewer, and we are organizing the Strider for Life uh, bike race, and it's to benefit the Flight for Life Summit County specific mm -hmm. um, entity that's here in our community. And this is our fifth race. Uh, we started in um, 2015. The race is actually tomorrow, and okay. it's at the Frisco Adventure Park. Um, this is a bike race for children, mm -hmm. and it's uh, one to five-year-olds, and they need to be on a balance bike. Um, we call it Strider for Life because uh, Strider Company has um, been supportive you know, of mm -hmm. this event. Um, it's not only a bike race for one to five year olds, um, and this is a pedalless bike, and they'll go around the, the course, and it's mm -hmm. a little dirt course, and there's obstacles. But so it's the a, course is what, like seven or eight miles or something, or is it like <laughs> 50 feet? Yeah, right. Well, you know, those little ones have a lot of energy. Yeah. So, <laughs> doing the parents a favor. Yeah. So, mm -hmm. right. so it's uh, mm -hmm. right there at the Frisco Adventure Park, and it's a dirt course, and it has obstacles that they need oh, cool. to go, that they can go through, and it's yeah. a rumble board and a little bridge and yeah. noodles. And the kids are very excited. They yeah. get into training mode. And this, this time is one of the bikes right here, right? Yes. yes. Mm -hmm. Those are really cool. Um, I kind of wish they would make them a little bit bigger so I could play on I them, know, but right? you know, uh, whatever. Yeah, <laughs> I'm sure you could just take the pedals off of your bike. Yeah, and just, just, just <laughs> kick around. Yeah, I think yeah. that'd be pretty awesome. Yeah. We also have a silent auction that I really need to, you know, make mention of because yeah, that's going that. to be in the. Um, um, the Day Lodge. Okay. And um, we have wonderful items that have been donated throughout all Summit County, all the right. businesses, restaurants, and gift certificates, um, ski mm -hmm. passes, golf packages, and um, that's going to be at the Day Lodge, but that's where the registration will be. Registration will start at 10 o'clock tomorrow morning, and uh -huh. the first race is at 11 o'clock. So registration tomorrow morning, Saturday, the 16th. Yes. 17th. 17th. 17th, right. Mm -hmm. And it's at 10 a.m. and the race starts at 11. At 11. And so we're doing silence auctions there as well. Yes. So the funding for that, where does that go to? I think. It mm -hmm. comes back to us at, at Flight for Life at yeah. our Frisco base here at the okay. local hospital. Um, and one of the, f one of the best um, silent auctions, you get a sunrise flight. Mm -hmm. in the in the helicopter and then a breakfast afterwards cool so beautiful time to see the county is mm -hmm. in the morning and so that'll be one of the silent auction items items that are are up so yeah. um but yeah all the proceeds the registration everything goes to us flight for life um, tell us tell me a little bit more about what flight for life is how long it's been around what so exactly do you do we, i think there are some confusions out there yeah so mm -hmm. we are an air medical um, transport um, yeah. program we were the first community-based hospital-based um, started in 1972 in denver mm -hmm. we are now five bases across the state um, and we provide critical transport of traumatic injured patients along with mm -hmm. medical patients to larger hospitals in the Front Range, right. mostly the Denver area. Um, um, and so we are not for profit, so we rely on a lot of fundraising to keep right. our mission going mm -hmm. and to be able to provide the service to our local community, which we love to be here for our, our people here in Summit County cool. and surrounding smaller counties. Um, mm -hmm. So um, these guys started Strider for Life um, the year after our tragic crash. Yeah. Um, and the first year the funds went to the Memorial Park yeah. that sits behind the ho hospital near the crash Yeah, and it's got a beautiful site. view and everything, yep. a little garden. Yep, yeah. it's gorgeous. Mm -hmm. um, and then uh, a couple of years ago it was for our Terra 2, our new ground mm -hmm. transport. So when we can't fly when it's bad weather, mm -hmm. you might have seen the orange uh, ambulance around, and mm -hmm. that's where the funds went towards that. It's the first four-wheel drive. Yeah, yeah. I don't know if you know this about me, but I've been in that van. I've been in that truck oh. before. I had a bad ski accident. I ruptured my spleen. Oh, okay. Bad storm came through. Couldn't fly. Couldn't, couldn't fly. Jumped in one of those. Yeah, and it was very helpful, and it probably saved my life. So yes. thank you so much for that. Yeah, yeah. you bet. Mm -hmm. You bet. We, we love what we do. Um, last year, it kind of went spread across the program. Yeah. Um, tomorrow, there will be our 
we have the state-of-the-art simulation lab right. where we can practice patient scenarios with adults, pediatrics, obstetrics, mm -hmm. whatnot. And so that'll be on, on view tomorrow along with the new Terra 2. Cool. Um, and then this year, um, the funds are going to go. We do a lot of rescue missions with search and rescue, uh, the Summit County Search and Rescue Group along with surrounding areas. And we're for a tool that will help us find people. Okay, cool. Um, a little better, mm -hmm. so. That's pretty amazing. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So this is going to yeah. be a huge event. It's over at the Frisco Adventure Park mm -hmm. um, yeah. by the, what was, the, what was the building called? The Day Lodge. The Day Lodge. Is where right. you check in. Mm -hmm. Right. And you also see the, the auction items mm -hmm. there. And, and then we'll have volunteers to be able mm -hmm. to assist, you know, in getting you down to the race course and the kids love to practice. Yeah. Um, and it's a huge community event, It's too. a huge community oh, event. It's, it's an event it's that people can come out with their families mm -hmm. and show and give thanks to Flight for Life, right. you know, um, the nurses, the paramedics, the pilots, the support mm -hmm. staff, and recognize how important it is for them to be yeah. in our community. Right. And um, it's a way that they can all do it together, and it's a great way for the kids to recognize, you know, the importance, because they're yeah. all they're all aware of the Flight for Life helicopter because they see it. Yeah, yeah. we always see it up in the yeah. sky. Yeah. It's, a, it's a busy yeah. community with it that. Is. You guys fly a lot. Yeah. So, um, <laughs> and I'll be there to start them off. Start the race. And then oh, we'll you're going to do the flight? Yep, and then awesome. we'll have another Flight for, Flight for Life crew member with the checkered flag at the end. Oh, cool. The end. So yeah. we'll That's be around awesome. to answer questions yeah. and yeah. have fun, and it's yeah. a great event, and it's fun to watch, and these kids all yeah. just excited and... Yeah, they're I mean, really on, good on, on these bikes. bikes. Are, it's pretty uh, entertaining. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. They yeah. got the big helmet on. They're all goofy looking. <laughs> and they all like, yeah. what am I doing yeah. with my arms and yeah. legs? Yeah. yeah, But I also awesome. wanted to thank also the sponsors and the businesses. Yeah. Yes. You know, because and we have all, all the sponsors all of the on years. these t-shirts too. So yeah. if the kids are coming out, make sure you grab one of these t-shirts. We have. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That's this. part of the registration package. Mm -hmm. Everyone that registers get a t-shirt. Cool. Mm -hmm. And then they'll be available um, until they're gone to, yeah. to also purchase. So mm -hmm. even if you don't have a little Strider mm -hmm. rider, come on mm -hmm. out, cheer them on, yeah. mm -hmm. bid on some great yeah. items from mm -hmm. our local businesses. Mm -hmm. And mm -hmm. um, you can also um, sign up today through the Stork and Bear. Cool. Um, mm -hmm. Otherwise, Tomorrow morning, 10 a.m.? Tomorrow awesome. morning. And then one more thing. Okay, we do ahead. have a bike clinic. So we do have kids that have kind of aged out over the years, mm -hmm. and they still want to be a part of the event. So Colorado Adventure Guides are actually yeah. going to be conducting four bike clinics. Oh, awesome. That for the five, well, it can be five to eight-year-olds mm -hmm. that are on pedals. So yeah. have the kids bring their pedal bikes, and then they can sign up for a clinic, and then there will also be a skills clinic for the strider bike rider, okay. you know, who wants to hone their skill also. So that's another addition to this event. And so far, uh, well, for the first four events that we've done over the f last four years, we've been able to raise over $85,000. That's amazing. For that's Flight so for a Life yeah, that we're stayed very here. Of that. Yeah. That's yeah. great. So yeah. it's another thank you to our community. Cool. And come out. We are yes, so excited for this it's event. It. It's fun. Yeah. All right. Cool. Well, thank you so much for joining us on Summer Sunrise Live thank today. Um, we look forward to the event thank tomorrow. You. It's going to be a beautiful day. So Gorgeous. And yeah. then that's, keep in mind, guys, we're going to check out weather here in just a few minutes. But yeah, thank you so much. We'll okay. see you guys real soon.